Hi Pisces, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your monthly reading for January 2018. Happy New Year. I have pre-shuffled this deck so I'm only going to shuffle it for a moment. Now this may not resonate with you because it is for a general audience. It's not a private reading. So I ask that you take what does and leave the rest. I will focus this camera in once I have the cards laid out. I'm trying to get it right. I guess that's pretty good. Okay, so it looks like there's, you know, some dishonesty somewhere. I'm not sure what this is, but there's some dishonesty. Somebody is not doing the right thing, and I'm not sure if that's you or the other person, but somebody isn't realizing something, you know, and I'm not sure what that is. Maybe they're not realizing the impact of their actions, okay? Um, I, there could be a third party situation somewhere. I'm not sure who this is for, but there could be a third party situation. I feel like, you know, somebody may be withdrawn, cold, not offering the emotional support. I'm not sure if that's you or another person that you're dealing with, but I feel like there's a coldness. There's a um, withdrawal of some sort. Perhaps somebody is contemplating leaving a situation. Um, you, maybe you need to make a choice between two people, okay? And you have to leave one of them to commit to the other. Um, there looks like somebody is juggling two people. I don't know if that's you or another person, but there is a, like a juggling going on here. Um, I feel like uh, there's definitely some depression going on, inner thoughts, you know, there's a lot of inner inner thoughts going on, inner dilemmas, you know, you're having these these emotions that you might not know where to how to deal with okay um, there's a transformation on the horizon okay big changes are coming this is for the month of January maybe you're looking for something more stable and secure than what you're in now and you, because of that you have to leave something else behind I feel like there is a um, a blockage of some sort. Maybe you are afraid of love. It looks like somebody is afraid of love here. They're afraid to give, let, let their emotions out, you know, to offer the love that somebody seek, seeks. Maybe somebody here is afraid of commitment, okay? Maybe there are some addictions that come into play. Maybe there's been some pretending, some faking, and now it's causing some, um, angst okay because now maybe somebody is wanting more of a commitment and somebody else is scared of that commitment i feel like there things are kind of slowing down this month as far as love goes there's a withdrawal i think there's a withdrawal um and i feel like maybe there's just a period of healing maybe somebody needs to go through some do some more healing before they can offer emotional support to somebody else maybe somebody is looking for marriage and the other person isn't quite ready for that i also feel like somebody isn't really thinking about the future they're living more in the now okay not really contemplating their future not planning for the future it's more of a i'm going to live for today not tomorrow okay kind of energy it feels like change is needed okay some kind of change is needed um, and i think things have reached kind of like a halt in some area of your life there's a, some kind of halt because I feel like a, a transformation is needed and it, this has to do with love for some of you um, for most of you that are watching this because we have a lot of cups here okay cups 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 
So I think in Five of Cups, I think that somebody has some regrets. They have some, um, you know, um, decisions to make. There's a decisions decision to make regarding love. Perhaps maybe somebody is walking away because love is not being offered freely. I feel like the love is not being offered freely. So I'm not sure if that's you or the other person. I'll tell you who we're dealing with. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and we're also doing, do, dealing with Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Okay, that's who we have here so far. We also have an Aquarius and a Sagittarius. But I feel like uh, there's things, something has been... Um, there's been some dishonesty. Somebody's been faking a situation, you know, faking their love, faking their emotional commitment to somebody. And I feel like now the the it's out on the table, you know, the, the truth needs to be told. Somebody is seeking the truth and, you know, that's causing a withdrawal. I see a withdrawal. I'm going to get the next deck. Um, Somebody's looking for a commitment and the other person is not quite ready to commit. Now this is the month of January. This um I, I see that somebody's not doing the right thing with that justice card being reversed. There there's something going on that isn't um serving you very well. Okay? Something is very heavy on your mind and your heart. And it's causing a, a feeling of not wanting to communicate, not wanting to talk about it, wanting to go within, wanting to um, not even be there in that situation, you know. Um, for somebody is in that's watching this is involved in a third party situation and perhaps it's time to make a decision. What are you going to do? Okay. And you may have regrets because somebody's going to get hurt out of the deal. I do believe there's a third party situation somewhere. Somebody's involved in a third party situation and somebody is going to get hurt because of it. And the thing is, is now I think it's out on the table. It's out of your control. Okay, it's out of your control. Maybe a secret has been revealed and the heaviness is, is being lifted. Okay, the, the, the secret has come out. Okay, a secret has come out. And now um, the heaviness is, is on the table for everybody to feel and see. And um, things could get a little chaotic, a little out of control. And you're trying to keep it under control. But when, you know, three is a crowd and perhaps somebody has spoken up and um, shook things up. And now it's a time of healing. But to do that, it feels like you need to withdraw. Okay. Um, there's definitely some depression, sadness, anxiety. Um, a, maybe a, a door is closing, you know, and it was a practical door. There was something that was very practical and dependable, and but somebody made a mistake. Somebody made a mistake with by not telling the truth, and perhaps now, you know, that is causing some regrets. I see regrets here, and I feel like... Um, you know, it's not, it doesn't, it doesn't appear to be the best month ever, Pisces, and I have to tell you the truth, because I, I can't, I can't just make shit up, okay, um, with the Wheel of Fortune being reversed, um, with the Justice being reversed, and these two Three of Cups here, and the Three of Wands, you know, I feel like, you know, three's a crowd, and I think the secret is about to come out, I'm not sure if it's with you or the other person, but a secret is about to come out and it is going to it's going to put things at a halt and cause some anxiety and chaos in your life. Um, and I'm sorry, I do apologize for that, but it's forcing a change that is needed. OK, and I feel like in the end, you your wishes and hopes, your hopes and wishes will be fulfilled in the end because it's going to force a renewal upon you okay but this month does not look like it is a month of good luck put it that way I think it is a month of trying to keep things under wraps trying to keep things under control trying to keep a secret but I don't think that's going to happen I think a secret is going to come out and it's going to cause some hurt and um, it, it's going to squash somebody's dreams 
I'm not sure if it's yours or the other person's, but with the star reversed there, it, I mean, this one's reversed and that one's upright. We have it twice, okay? Somebody has big wishes for the future, but it appears that the future isn't being considered. It looks like there's consequences for actions here, and it's going to squash somebody's, somebody's dreams, and it's really, really going to hurt. But it's also going to be a relief because you're not going to have to carry this around anymore, okay? So the month of January is about the truth coming out regarding a situation, Pisces. Some truth is going to come out, okay? Some dishonesty that has affected your life is going to come out. And it's going to actually be a huge relief for you. It's going to be a huge relief. It's going to bring balance to your life, believe it or not. Whatever this, whatever this comes out, you know, the, it's going to be the end of um, carrying this weight around, okay? Maybe there's legal issues. Maybe you've been going to court and maybe in January it's the end, okay? I do feel like, you know, it's the end of a difficult time, but somebody's going to get hurt out of it. The first card is the Law of Attraction. Each thought is an investment that pays immediate dividends, so invest wisely. You have the power to choose your thoughts and align them with love, peace, and harmony. At your request, we will gladly attune your energies to higher frequencies. Your thoughts become things. Remember that. From Archangel Michael, spend more time outdoors. My prayer, thank you for motiva motivating me to spend more time outdoors and for helping me relax and enjoy connecting with nature. So I see that one, what I see is one, one phase is ending, okay? One phase is ending. One dilemma is ending, okay? And it's going to be a huge relief. And you will need time to heal from it. You will need time to get over it. You will need time to process. And you may go through a period of withdrawal because of it. Because it's heavy. It's heavy. But once it comes to light, once it ends, it's going to be a huge relief. So I think this month is about some dishonesty, some lie, something like that coming out. That changes everything. It, it pushes you into a transformation of sorts. We have the death card underneath here. I feel like for many of you, you are about to start a new phase of life. But that's scary. And I feel like, you know, it might be a little overwhelming in January. So this is what I have. I'm sorry this isn't the, the butterflies and rainbows that some people want to see, but that's life. Life doesn't always bring. I mean, life isn't fair. So relief is coming. Unfortunately, before the relief, the, the shit has to come out. So it's going to. So this is what I have, Pisces, for the month of January. Happy New Year. And don't, don't um, go into hiding for too long, okay? Try not to. This too shall pass. Your thoughts become things. Talk to you later.